Good afternoon, brothers and sisters in Christ. I plead the blood of Jesus over this video and everybody who's watching. I pray your day is blessed in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So as we know, there's life and death and the power of the tongue, right? And even though we go through things, sometimes it is difficult to speak life, especially when you're going through a storm or a trial. But God promised never to leave nor forsake us, and he promises to bless us. So I want to read to you Psalm 16, verse 7 to 11. Very powerful. I will bless the Lord who has given me counsel. My heart also instructs me in the night seasons. I have set the Lord always before me. Because he is at my right hand, I shall not be moved. Therefore, my heart is glad and my glory rejoices. My flesh also will rest in hope. For you will not leave my soul in Sheol, nor will you allow your Holy One to see corruption. You will show me the path of life. In your presence is fullness of joy. At your right hand are pleasures forevermore. Isn't that beautiful? Also, I want to add verse 6 because I, I meant to highlight it. Actually, I'll go to five. I'm sorry. I meant to highlight five and six as well. Oh, Lord, you are my portion of my inheritance and my cup. You maintain my lot. The lines have fallen to me in pleasant places. Yes, I have a good inheritance. See how scripture can bless you. You can speak scripture over your own life because this word of God is alive. And the more that you speak scripture which God doesn't speak something and have it go out and come back void. What I'm saying is to speak life over your situation. And even though you don't see it, our hope is found in Jesus Christ. Even Jesus said true faith is not in seeing, but true faith is not seeing, but believing. And our blessed hope is in our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I hope this blesses you today and every day. Amen.